everyone, my name is Steph, this is Kidlit Joy, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here to review Brave Paw and the Heartstone of Illyria by L. M. Wilkinson. This is Lily Wilkinson's pen name for her junior fiction titles. This is the first book in a new series, and I was so excited to see it come out. I love Lily Wilkinson's writing, and to see her writing for a younger audience is great because I will possibly be reading this as our next class read aloud now that I have finished reading it so I can review it. It is an absolutely delightful little story of bravery. The blurb says, one small mouse, one epic quest. Titch has always longed for adventure, just like the gallant mouse hero Brave Paw in all her favorite stories. But she's the smallest mouse in her family, living in a peaceful little village where nothing exciting ever happens until dire trouble comes to the plateau. Titch and her best friend Huckleberry must set out on a dangerous quest to take the Heartstone to repair the crack in the heart of Valuria before the whole world breaks apart. Can Titch ever hope to live up to the legend of Brave Paw? The story opens with Titch playing and pretending to be Brave Paw, and as, as it says, she's the smallest mouse in her village. And basically she just keeps getting told by her mother, no, you just need to come and do your chores. Just stop playing, come and, come and do your chores until some dangerous creatures and critters turn up and Titch has to step up and has to be brave and set out on this adventure to fight a rising evil and try and repair this crack from which all of these sort of evil critters are coming from. It means leaving home for the first time, it means setting out on her own and, and Huckleberry, her friend, being brave and joining her and, and seeing that she isn't by herself and along the way they face all sorts of challenges the first part is just you know they leave the plateau and suddenly they don't know where they are anymore because they've never been outside of their home and then there are some bandits who are capturing magical creatures and they have to step up and try and help which earns them an ally and the whole thing is filled with whimsy and magic and is just delightful the text is a very good size for the age category there's lots of illustrations the whole way through from Lavanya, Naidu and it was just so fun. It's got some great themes, it's great to talk about how do you be brave in the face of something scary, how do you step up and do the right thing even if it's hard sometimes. So I am looking forward to the second book when it comes out, hopefully the second book is out soon. This does release on September the 3rd and I hope that people will check it out. I will leave links down below where you can find out more information about the book, the author and the illustrator and in the comments I'd love to know are you planning on picking up Brave Paw or do you have recommendations that sound similar to this title? Feel free to leave them below. If you want to let me know that you're here but you don't leave a comment feel free to leave any kind of heart emoji down below otherwise I hope that wherever you're on the world you're staying safe and healthy and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye everyone.